It is April 2nd, 2015. Do you know where your Veda is? I just got back from the gym. And I am exhausted. All this 5K training. It's a lot of work. But I made it through the day. It was a very difficult run today, but somehow I managed to stay on that treadmill and finish the run. And I get to do it all again on Saturday. But all of this training for a 5k is really cut into my binge watching. As you can see, I've got quite a few TV shows to watch. Okay, so to be fair, I've watched pretty much everything I have. Uh, except for a couple of them. And you combine all of this with stuff like Netflix. Well, it appears that I enjoy my entertainment options. And it really is pretty awesome that we have access to all of these creative things that people have done for all of these years. All of these TV shows and all of those movies that I have over there. Plus the fact that you've got Netflix and you've got Hulu and you've got all the stuff on TV. There's quite a few shows that I enjoy binge watching. But it's not just TV shows and movies that I love. I also love to read and I tend to binge read as well. Now that I have my Kindle, I enjoy reading all that much more. I mean, seriously, I can download pretty much anything I could possibly want to read. And they're cheaper than paperbacks, and I can carry hundreds of books on this tiny little thing right here in my hand. It's absolutely amazing. But the question of today is actually, which shows do I enjoy binge watching? And though I do enjoy the occasional binge of a TV show I've never seen before, like, say, you know, perhaps Game of Thrones, or The Walking Dead, I have some of my old standards that I go to quite often. And a few of the shows that I really enjoy watching over and over again are shows like Stargate, SG-1, Smallville, Buffy, Angel, and of course, my all-time favorite, Firefly. And now, it is time to eat. So I will bid you adieu. Thank you, as always, for watching. And thanks for being awesome.